let me be gentle so i i can I don't never analyze or judge what the opponents do what they have done so the best way to silence all trap points have the ball have the ball lots of passes okay we'll go to jack go on please at the mail hi Pat. um how impressed were you with that performance and the element of control that you had in the very first minute uh, I didn't hear you well, Jack. Can you repeat? Sorry. Um, how how impressed were you with the performance and how much control you had yeah. of the game from the first minute? Absolutely. Huge deserve credit and my admiration again, my pride to to, to these players, the commitment and uh, yeah, the fact that we play a, a really good game from the beginning until the end, except ten minutes, the first ten minutes, second half that we miss. Some stupid balls, let me create a little bit of environment, but the best way to silence all trap points have the ball, have the ball, lots of passes, and in the right moment attack to to the box. So yeah, we did it and yeah, so we play a really good game. Do you think you had a few more gears to get through in the second half if you needed to? Could you have attacked a little bit more in the second half? No, I ask in the half time more passes. We had to pass more the ball. So when you make a little the transition or you attack a little bit quicker than then you need to be to be to attack. They they will attack him much much quicker. In positions they are much better. So when you allow Rashford, Cristiano, and contact with Ruben, uh, Bruno Fernandez, and the transition are good. So we had to wrestle together, and, and with that is more passes, more passes, more passes. Maybe we don't have a lot of chances in this way, but the chances are more clear and enough to to win the games and. Uh, and all the people back four and Eddie and people in the middle in the respect the position from Gabby and and um, and Phil. So yeah, it was a real good thing. John Murray, please. Uh, you said before the match that uh, you felt it was important for this match to have a left footer on the left and a right footer on the right. Why was that the case against United for, for this particular match? Because again, back five, when you go left, they go to by line, you break all back five. And with a back five, you play in opposite foot, uh, leg. So right foot in the left, you go inside, they wake you. Uh, and that's why we thought like they got a good result against Tottenham, uh, play five in the back. Uh, we thought the best way is play field in left and, and guard in right. In the, both can play in different positions. So is that during the game, I thought or we thought that uh, they could play in different positions. Gabi can play left and field and right. So it's not a problem. But in that positions, you make the actions to the byline and you drop them and you, you can make more more efficient your, your attacks. Rob Draper, please. Yeah, hi, Pep. I just wonder also with the back three, does it leave them with not a lot to do when you, you've packed the midfield and you've got your attacking players wide? It, it, the, the back three can almost look confused and have less to do and leaves you, the midfield, to dominate. The back three from Liverpool, from United. Rob? Yeah? The, the, back, the back three for United? Yeah, the back three for United, yeah. No, but... but no. Let me be gentle, so I I can I don't never analyze or judge what the opponents do, what they have done. So listen, the games have been quite similar the last previous seasons that they beat us it's because they weighed us behind and then use the one mistake and they punish us in the counter attack. So they they didn't control the game. They they were not. You know, doing the games, they wait us maybe because they respect us. That is a big compliment for us, and we did our game. And and of course, with the players in the middle, with the Rodri is an exceptional top form. Kevin is back today, you know his level, and and Bernardo, they have a quality to have the ball. And we want to have the ball and have the ball and have the ball. It's the only way you can control the transitions and the big speed and. The, the you know and, and let them run so i know the big talents players like cristiano or bruno fernandez or rashford greenwood and uh, all of them so they suffer when they don't have the ball they suffer and what we want is that is, is let them run to have the ball in the right moment attack 
Hi, Perth. Um, Oli spoke about uh, United being the biggest club in Manchester, but have you proved today that you're the best team in Manchester? Listen, for our fans, Manchester City is the best club in Manchester. For Red fans, uh, United is the best club. So only we can say the last years uh, we have done really well. Come to Stuart, we have done guys. really well. Uh, Winning a lot of titles and being there all the time. So that's why after six seasons together, I still see the team how run, how fight, how good they play. That made me so proud. Mr. Stuart running, guys, and then we'll go into the embargo for a couple of questions. If there are any hands now at the time, Stuart, please. Okay. Hi, Pep. Hi. Um, you said before the game that your team couldn't do what Liverpool did. But you did, didn't you? Apart from the fact that David De Gea had a world class game, you pretty much did what, what Liverpool did. Do you not, you know, you know, the, I'm saying Liverpool attack a different way they attack, and I know my admiration about Liverpool, uh, the work from Jurgen. So it's not necessary to tell you the toughest opponent. So he's uh, still is there after six, seven years. He's here. He's, the first season struggled a little bit to, to put the team there, but after they settled the team and they bought the right players what they need, and Liverpool is. Uh, He's there, but we, we play in a different way because I am from Catalonia, he's from Germany. Maybe our grew up, our mentality, our built up as a, as a coach, as manager, it's a different concept. But both, I think, Liverpool and City, they are controlled the, the Premier League in the last years. It's the fact that it doesn't matter where we are. In fact, the matter where we play, home away, we go there to do our game. Uh, and after the quality of the player make the rest, for example, also a Liverpool player for nine with Firmino, and we play with for uh, for um, uh, for Bernardo. And but the difference that the wingers they have, they play more central, and our wingers play more wider. But both teams, and anyone can deny that both teams, it doesn't matter play in England, Europe, they go there and try to do the game. And and today we came here in front of uh, you know an Old Trafford. Our rivals of the city uh, against against our neighbors and said, "Okay, we come here and we will do our game. We will play. This is allowed to win or lose. I don't know. The game is quite similar like we played the previous season. So we control, we control, and they wait uh, an action, you know, for the counter attack, one set pieces, one action to punish us. But the control always was in our hands in these five, six years, all the time. Uh, but they are so good, and if we didn't want it, just let them run. And who is the best way to let them run? Have the ball, have the ball, they have the ball, and passes and passes and passes. Be in the position, the ball go where we are, and after the quality, my friend, the quality, the players that we have, make the rest. 